today. We welcomed the announcement that two South African teams will be joining the competition. Exciting times ahead. Yeah, groundbreaking. I mean, it's been mooted for a long time with the English clubs and the French clubs and the South Africans and um, the, the, the Pro 12 have actually gone and done it. So, yeah, it's, it, it puts a nice twist on the competition. It makes it a little bit um, uh, more exciting. And, um, yeah, there's obviously a, a couple of weeks in South Africa for us by the looks of it. But, yeah, no, it'd be great to, to get them here and be great for our supporters and, um, and the Pro 14 to, to lead the way. Certainly the Chiefs have got a great history, they're a big physical team, Kings play a good brand and they've had actually the best season in Super Rugby um, since, they were, to see, since they were formed. It'll be interesting to see how they, how they travel, how they like the, uh, the British weather, uh, it'll be interesting and also for ourselves to go and, and play in the summer in, in South Africa will be, uh, it'll be, it'll be tough for us too. And the conference structure, it's something fresh, something different, how do you think the, the teams and the players will adapt to that? Yeah, it'll be interesting to see how that. Uh, it's the first time I've, um, I've I've coached in that in that format. Obviously, top three is very important, and then qualification for Europe. So, um, and obviously you're throwing international weekends in the middle of that as well. So there's there's a lot to think about, lots to a lot to uh, to plan and make sure you you get it right. But yeah, I think it's um, like I say, I think that the, the Pro 12 now the Pro 14 are leading the way, and I think if it works, it'll it'll be a lot of interest from the Premiership and. Um, and, and the, the top 14 in France that uh, they'll want to get on, on, the, on the same type of thing.